Beauty! Beauty! Where is this girl? Where is she? Beauty! Baby. Good morning, Mom. What is wrong with you? Why, why are you throwing up? I don't know. I'm just feeling sick. Probably something I ate. Yeah, come here. Come here. You're looking so unwell. You need to sort yourself out, right? Try and see the doctor. Hmm? You'll be strong. Um, you have to take this clothes to the dry cleaner much later in the day and make sure you bring them back, right? Don't forget, it's very important. I'll talk to your dad downstairs. Yeah, rest, rest. Lie down. Keep them somewhere and lie. Lie. Yes, we don't hold it. Oh. Yeah, right there. Here, play with this. You'll be fine, right? Yeah, come. Mm. Mm. See you much later in the day. You're not going to work today. I will. I just have some important things to do and some some mails to reply. Oh, that's nice. Um, I'm off to work. And meanwhile, Beauty is not looking good at all. She's a bit sick and she's been throwing up. Really? Yes, please. Honey, is it possible you just uh, take her to the hospital to see the doctor? Sure, I will. All right, honey. All right. Take care, my love. Love you. Have a nice day. Love you, you too. too. All right. Um. Ah. Mm. <sighs> All right. <sighs> what is this I hear that you're not feeling fine? I'm not feeling too well. And you couldn't tell me? You told your mother. What is wrong with you? Eh? I didn't tell her. She came to my room and found me. All right. Don't, look. don't worry. She's not going to find mm -mm -mm. me. Get dressed. We're going to the hospital. Come on, come on. Don't worry. I am just feeling tired. I'll be fine. Let me just get some rest. I am not asking you. I am telling you we are going to the hospital. Get dressed now. Fine. I'm downstairs. Congrats, girl. Mm -mm. <laughs> it's been one deal after another. You're doing nice, though. I like that. <laughs> My darling. See ya, Chelsea. Mm -hmm. I covered a lot of milestones this period to get to this level. I can answering. imagine. And I'm so grateful to God for everything. It's been one success from one success to another. Now, let's wait for the promotion of becoming the bank manager. And I'm not seeing any obstacle on the way. <laughs> I know that one is going to happen for sure. Definitely. I know it's a promotion after this. Mm -hmm. Definitely. <laughs> so how do you intend to manage your... Um, work you know and um of course responsibility at home because you being a manager now that's a whole lot of responsibility so how do you want to balance work and the home front how do you mean i don't understand oh haven't you thought about it thought about what sweetheart you're a working class woman now okay that means you have more responsibility to shoulder on your body so the thing is work you have to be at home of course and you have to be at work so how do you want to balance it okay the truth is that 
My husband is there to take care of everything in the house. And my daughter too. And my daughter we're talking about, she's no longer a child. She's a teenager, so what are we talking about? Babe, it takes more than just being married or giving birth to a child. Your daughter needs you. Your husband needs you. You have to balance it. Do not let anyone be lagging behind. That's what I'm saying. And no one is lagging behind here because I got married to the best of man in this world. He takes care of my daughter, he takes care of himself, and he takes care of me so everything is under control. All right, darling, what about your daughter? She's a teenage girl. She needs you more. This is the time you guys need to bond. This is the time she has issues. She needs to talk to you. How do you tend to do that? Like I said before, my husband is there to handle everything. Huh. Okay. So okay. relax yourself. Enjoy my success with me. No, Wahala. For your sake, I hope it's all true. It is it's all true. You might regret it. It is all true. <laughs> Let's cheers to my promotion of becoming the manager. All right, darling. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Chelsea, relax yourself. Mm. Relax. I just hope you won't regret it though. Never. Uh, Never. <laughs> Yeah, so Doctor, what is the outcome? What is wrong with her? Well, the usual. She's pregnant. Uh, so, not again now. Beauty, what is wrong with you? Are you a child? Why is that any little thing you just get pregnant? If I told you, you get pregnant, you get pregnant at random. No, now, it's, it's, it's unfair now. Ah, ah, ah. You, you should know what to do. You should know how to take care of yourself. Uh, I'm, I'm supposed to be teaching you all those things. Why are you putting me through all the stress? It's unfair. <sighs> Frank, you don't need to blame her. You are the one that's supposed to carry the, the, the blame. It's your fault. You sleep with her without protection. So what do you expect? A plasma TV. Huh? Look. I, I, I expect her to be reasonable and considerate. Why is there any little thing I touch? She gets pregnant. Eh? Is it fair? Look, I can't be sleeping with her without protection. There's no enjoyment in that. Well, I understand you. But if you think that is something you are going to give her to remedy this situation, then go ahead and do it. Fine. Look. I have very important things to do. My head is so full with activities. I don't have time for this. Look, Bitty, let's go. We'll sort this out later. But I'm not feeling fine. Don't worry about that. I'm going to give you something to stabilize you. You see, you need to be okay. All right? Uh, look, Doc, we'll be waiting for you in the car. I am not supposed to be seen handling that kind of drugs around here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Don't forget to send them um, the amount. Look, the next time you get pregnant again, I will strangle you with that child. <laughs> All right, Doc. Thank you. Take care. Yes.